want to, to talk to you about uh, a very sensitive topic, one that can be really hard to talk about, and that's, you know, are you hurting or are you struggling? You know, I've been at places in my life before where it felt like no one would understand, no one would really care what I was going through, or, you know, how would I even tell someone? Where would I even start? You know, it's in times of my life, it's been financial things going on. It's been relationship things going on. Um, it's been all aspects of life, my health even. And I internalized it. So instead of going out and finding someone to talk to, finding a, a brother in Christ to sit down and say, hey, you know, this is what I'm going through. Or even going to, a, you know, a professional, going to a counselor and seeking help or a doctor. I internalized it. I did things that seemed like the things I needed to do. But, you know, that's not the best way to do it. Because the impact that had on my life was, you know, it caused stress. It caused worry. It caused my personality to change at times. Because when I was stressed about something or I had something going on that I was trying to deal with myself, do you know what happened? I mean, it made me a different person. So I responded in different, you know, tones. I, you know, had a short temper, a short fuse. I didn't do things the way they should have been done. And if you're in that situation, if you're hurting or you're struggling, whether it's financial or relationship or you know it's your job or your health or whatever it is I mean the Bible is really clear about this matter it's very specific seek counsel and wisdom of others go talk to others go seek that knowledge that others have because it's amazing what happens when we start opening up when we start seeking help it's amazing how God opens up doors that will someone will say something, somebody will recommend something, or somebody knows someone that can help that we would have never thought of. That I would have never even thought, oh, hey, I need to go do this. So I want to encourage you, if you're in that situation, if that's what you're going through, I know it, it feels like, you know, it's embarrassing, or what are others going to think, or, you know, all kinds of things that ran through my head. But the sooner that I started seeking help, the sooner things started coming back around to being manageable. And that's what I encourage you to do. If you're seeking, I mean, if you need that help, if you need someone to talk to, if you need, whether it's professional or someone just in your church or a Christian brother or Christian sister, seek them out. Do it now. Don't delay. Don't procrastinate just find someone to help you because that's what God wants for us God wants us to have blessings in our life he wants us to have joy and contentment in our life and if we're trying to deal with things all by ourselves and it's causing us to have issues in our life then we can't have those things that God has for us I hope this has been an encouragement to you, and I truly hope you'll find someone who can help you. And if I can help you in any way, you know, ch check out my website, handlinglife.org, and don't hesitate to reach out to me to see if I can help you. And if I can't help you, hopefully I can find someone who can.